May we strive and pray to be wholly independent of and indifferent to man's opinion, so long as we please God. May we remember the woe pronounced by our Master. Woe be unto you, when all men shall speak well of you. But though giving ourselves wholly to these things, we shall not win the praise of men, we shall attain the far more important end of usefulness to souls. Acknowledge to the full the doctrine of the sovereignty of God in the salvation of sinners. I acknowledge that those who preach best and live nearest to God have not always been honoured in their lives for the saving of many souls. The man who is most entirely and holy Jesus Christ's man, a man of one thing, who lives Sunday and weekday, everywhere, home and abroad, as a man whose single endeavour is to give himself to the work of Jesus Christ. This is the man, this is the minister, who will generally, in the long run, do most good.